Fasting is really popular for people who want to lose weight. And it's one of the number one things that I see when I go to pro-anorexia websites. People talking about fasting. How did you do it? How many days did you go? What did you have on your fast? If your sister has a history of disordered eating, or if your sister is constantly preoccupied with her weight and her size, it is very possible that she is using fasting as an excuse to, con to continue her disordered eating behavior. Now, your sister, even if those things qualify, which we don't know, but let's say they do, may believe with all of her heart that the only reason she's fasting is for a spiritual discipline because in her mind she's found a way to excuse this behavior and it's a very easy and acceptable thing to be able to say, well, I'm doing this for good reasons. So I encourage you to really challenge your sister. Challenge other things besides the fasting. If she's obsessive about her weight in general, talk to her about that. Um, you know, talk to her about, are you, you know, are you afraid of food? I notice sometimes that even when you're not fasting, you know, you may not be eating the, the right amounts of foods. Just ask her different questions, but draw her out in dialogue about what might be going on. At the end of the day, there's nothing you can say that's going to change her mind. But you don't have to feel pressured that you're not being spiritual enough um, because you're not fasting. You just got to let your sister work through those issues and maybe encourage her to really um, look into whether this is genuinely a spiritual discipline or if maybe she's crossed a little bit of a line.